one that I was thinking about. Yeah. Actually, it feels pretty light. We're back, freshy baby. Look at this thing. It's a nice 20 degree day here in New York. This thing loaded, the whole side of the truck's covered in ice. Try not to lay it down before I get on the first ride. Back to the house, give you guys a little run over my plans. Big bad 450, no more 250s. Long awaited. Got this thing torqued down, use my torque straps. Should be good to go. We'll get back to the house, get that battery plugged in. Whew. Finally, we're back. It was a short little hour drive. Only a good day for it. Beautiful New York, still snow on the ground. How cold it is too, my whole truck is covered in ice. We had an ice storm. You're really missing out on a lot if you don't live in New York. So sick, not seeing one in person yet. Kind of iffy on the side shroud and with the front number plate, but seeing it in person, it looks way better. If you are quite surprised, I got a 450 and didn't get another 250. Here it is time for a change up, change up all around, 450 Yamaha, switching it up from the Hondas and Cowies. So I was due for a change. Here in New York, we probably have another two months before I'm even able to ride this thing. There's still snow on the ground right now. I'm gonna rip the suspension off, get that shipped out, get it all redone, get some fancy coatings, have this thing looking cool. And in about a month, we'll have all the parts in and we should be able to finally ride this thing. Let's get this suspension off. Boom, quick and easy. Got this stuff taken out. Get everything shipped out and we'll see these things in a couple weeks. So the bike's been sitting here for like two or three months now. I've been trying to hide it in the background of all my current videos. Finally just got the suspension back from JBI. I'll leave his link down below in the description. We got the shock all set up. Got these forks all coated up, redone. These things came out sick. It's like a blue to purple fade in the sun. JBI hooked it up with some fancy bolts. These things thrown on there and see how the bike looks. And then finally be able to test this thing out and ride it. See if I can handle this 450. These things are so sick. And finally, we got this thing all finished up. The forks look so sick. They pop when they're out here in the sun. You can kind of see more of that blue to purple fade down on the bottom. I really did just swap out the bars. Always with every build, I have some Raptor titanium foot pegs. Threw a new cover on there. This thing's ready to go. I have some graphics coming, seat cover. So if you're looking to get your suspension coated or fully set up like mine, JBI suspension is the place to go. I'll leave all his info in the description if you want to get your bike dialed in. I've actually had this for a while. Yoshi hooked me up with a pipe, so you'll see that probably in the next video. Putting this thing on, getting a little sound test. All right, finally the first ride on the new 450. As usual, I'm late. I'm gonna torque this thing down. The torque and strap this thing down with my torque straps. The best moto straps in the market right now. I'll leave them linked below. Get on our way here. All right, let's see how this thing feels. This thing feels smooth, like I thought it was gonna be way more aggressive. I don't even know what map it's on, it's just whatever, whatever it came out of the box. I didn't even adjust anything. I wish I rode it stock to see how it was with the stop suspension, but the suspension feels really good from JBI. No complaints so far, I like it.
day two, testing out the 450. First impressions and first ride from the other day. Hopefully today I'll get a little more comfortable on it. On the top of that, that was the first time I've ridden in the past like eight months. The last time I rode was in October. So we're definitely pretty rusty. The only time I've ridden a 450 was in Spain when I tested out that Stark Varg and I rode a Cowie 450. The only time I've ever ridden a 450. So definitely have some work to do, that's for sure. Get loaded up and get out to the track today. And on top of that, we got a fresh set of boots thanks to MXBoot.com. They got me dialed in with these new limited edition purple with blue. So if you need a new set of boots, MX Boot is the place to go. His link will be down below. Use my discount code Tyler if you want to get 10% off your order. Man, it feels like old times right now. Mike's already out here. Got the fresh yellow machine. All right, second practice. When I was mud fast, so I came back in. And hopefully it's shaped up good now. Let's go have some fun. All right, so quickly, I wanna thank a longtime sponsor, Onyx Off-Road, for making this video possible. So at this point, if you haven't downloaded Onyx Off-Road, what are you doing? If you do anything off-road, from dirt bikes, side-by-sides, trucks, ATVs, snowmobiles, this is the best app you can have if you're looking for new trails to ride. You can zoom in and out on the map, and every single blue point represents new trails to ride near you. If you're sick of going to the same trails and you're burnt out on riding the same thing, this is perfect. What the app allows you to do is put in your location, it'll find all the trails nearby, click on the point, you can see all the pictures of people that have been there. It gives you a full description of what you can expect and what you're going to get into. Not only that, once you get there, you can click on the nearby trails and it'll give you a list of trails nearby that you can also go to. Say you're doing a little weekend trip or a road trip, this makes it super easy. But also with that, you can get GPS navigation without cell service, which is crucial for a lot of these off-road parks and trails. And with that, even without service, you can track your trips from your starting point so you'll never get lost. So all you have to do is download the map before you go, and you're good to go. So Onyx Off-Road is the number one off-road GPS GPS app. And right now, you can start with the seven day free trial before you commit to anything, or you can sign up right now using my link in the description along with my discount code on the screen to get 20% off your first membership. So I don't know what you're waiting for. Go download Onyx Off Road to help support me along with the sponsors that make these videos possible. So with that, we'll get back to the first ride at this new 450.
a wrap on the day. First ride video on the new 450. Let me know if you guys are pumped to finally have some track videos back. It feels like the old days of going to the track. It's just the start for the season, so expect a lot more track and riding videos. I don't know if you could tell, but I felt a lot more comfortable today than I did the first ride. So if you're new, subscribe. Throw a like in the video if you're pumped for more videos like this one. Don't forget to check out Onyx Off-Road. It's the top link in the description. And on that, I will see you guys in the next video.